Welcome to Stock Invest YouTube channel and this stock report for Apple. The report was first published on our website April 7, 2022, but this is a more detailed version which also includes some fundamental data you need to know. In this 7 to 10 minute long video we give you the information you need to know about Apple for the upcoming trading day on Friday 8th, like support and resistance levels, signals, chart analysis, price to earnings ratios, and possible trading levels. Make sure you watch the entire report so you don't miss out on some key information needed for your trading. Please remember to subscribe so we can continue to grow and give you these free videos. Make sure to hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new video. Now just sit back, relax, listen and watch the screen as we will show you some interesting data as we move along with the report. In this section you will get some information about the current Apple performance to better understand the where the stock is right now. In our systems, the Apple stock currently holds a minus 1.080 score, and our system has ranked Apple sell candidates since April 6, 2022. In this period the stock has so far done better than what our systems expected and had a gain of 0.38%. This is an average return of 0.19% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Apple our last headline reads, Apple stock price ended on $172.17 on Thursday after gaining 0.38%. The Apple stock price gained 0.38% on the last trading day, Thursday, April 7, 2022, rising from $171.52 to $172.17. During the day the stock fluctuated 2.07% from a day low at $169.85 to a day high of $173.36. The price has been going up and down for this period, and there has been a minus 1.09% loss for the last two weeks. Volume fell on the last day by minus 12 million shares and in total, 66 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $11.34 billion. You should take into consideration that falling volume on higher prices causes divergence and may be an early warning about possible changes over the next couple of days. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $182.94, and the lowest price was $122.25. Right now the price is 5.89%, or $10.77, below 52-week high and 73.56%, or $479.09, below all-time high June 6, 2014 where the price hit $651.26. The Apple Stock Trends, Predictions and Analyst Ratings Soon we will give you the analyst ratings for the stock, but first the trends. The stock is moving within a wide and horizontal trend and further movements within this trend can be expected. The current three-month trend indicates a possible 0.0800% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 11.84% and 4.62%. The 12-month trend it indicates a 34.07% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between 20.62% and 52.38%. This equals a price between $207.67 and $262.36 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets On Friday, March 11, 2022 Barclays set target to $169 to $170. On Tuesday, February 15, 2022 Tigris Financial set target to $198 to $210. On Monday, January 31, 2022 Credit Suisse set target to $150 to $168. On Friday, January 28, 2022 Oppenheimer set target to $170 to $190. From analysts Apple stock received a general strong buy rating. The analysts give P.E. ratio a strong buy and price to book a strong buy rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the Apple stock a neutral rating. In this section we will give you some information about signals found for Apple. We will start with the general picture before we move on some of the most famous indicators and signals that will give you a deeper and better understanding of the trading possibilities in the stock. The Apple stock holds a sell signal from the short-term moving average, at the same time, however, there is a buy signal from the long-term average. Since the short-term average is above the long-term average there is a general buy signal in the stock giving a positive forecast for the stock. 
On further gains, the stock will meet resistance from the short-term moving average at approximately $174.85. On a fall, the stock will find some support from the long-term average at approximately $166.48. A breakup through the short-term average will send a buy signal, whereas a breakdown through the long-term average will send a sell signal. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence (MACD). Volume fell during the last trading day despite gaining prices. This causes a divergence between volume and price and it may be an early warning. The stock should be watched closely. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Tuesday, March 29, 2022, and so far it has fallen minus 3.79%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence holds a buy signal. Pivots gave a sell signal 8 days ago. Bollinger gave a buy signal 8 days ago. The short-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a buy signal five days ago. The long-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a buy signal 14 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages in the three-month chart gave a buy signal 12 days. If we look at the 12-month chart we see, short moving average gave a sell signal three days ago. The long-term moving average gave a buy signal 14 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages gave a buy signal 8 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for Apple Apple finds support from accumulated volume at $170.33 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $3.51 between high and low, or 2.07%. For the last week, the stock has had a daily average volatility of 2.08%. Next upcoming earnings report for Q1 2022 is expect to be released April 26, 2022. The consensus among the analysts are $1.43. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, Apple meets first resistance at $172.19. If you do not hold Apple shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn Apple finds first level of support at $170.33 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. Other levels you should watch based on the famous Fibonacci model are Buy at $170.45, $169.62, Sell at The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for Apple is strong buy. Here are some of the latest insider trades. On April 4, 2022 O'Brien Dardiari made an inside sell of 60,936 of restricted stock unit. On April 4, 2022 O'Brien Dardiari made an inside sell of 11,701 of common stock. On April 4, 2022 O'Brien Dardiari made an inside sell of 17,497 of common stock. On April 4, 2022 Williams Jeffrey E. made an inside sell of 60,936 of restricted stock unit. On April 4, 2022 Williams Jeffrey E. made an inside sell of 59,064 of restricted stock unit. Based on the 100 latest insights trades, we have calculated the insider power to be negative at a ratio of minus 28.866. In total, the insiders bought 7,544,913 and sold 13,767,127 shares in the last 100 trades. We hold a negative evaluation for this stock, no stop loss set. Is Apple stock a buy?
Apple holds several negative signals and we believe that it will still perform weakly in the next couple of days or weeks. We, therefore, hold a negative evaluation of this stock. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For the trading on Friday 8th we expect Apple to open down negative 38 cents and start trading at $171.79. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching. Leave a comment if you have any questions and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.